You know, something I, I picked up at home. My dad, um, he had, my dad had a 1957 uh, Golden Hawk, so a supercharged car that he had when my parents got married. And they had a mishap. My mom uh, impaled it or something, and that was the end of that. So my dad, when uh, when I got interested in cars and, and uh, brought my first car home, he was pretty excited about it. And so he helped me a lot, and he taught me most of what I know about mechanicing. And so it was just, it was kind of, you know, in the family that way. It was kind of a suggestion to me uh, from a, just a young family man that's here uh, that I know. And he first suggested, just kind of as a, you know, kind of a personal interest thing for me, why don't you get a, uh, you know, he was thinking just a, like a personal car for me, you know, that we would work on it together. And I said, no, 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 no. Let's you know, put somebody through seminary. Uh, it's expensive. It's like graduate school. We're doing a raffle for this car, $25 a, a ticket, and uh, we're able in, in New Mexico to, to pay the taxes for it. So um, whoever wins the car is going to win it for a $25 ticket and drive it home. All the proceeds uh, for this raffle uh, will be donated back to the uh, to the Diocese of Gallup for the vocations office and so it will go to pay the tuition for seminarians who are studying to become priests. Uh, the Gallup's a pretty poor diocese. Of all, it's, uh, of course we're in the country we have uh, seven Indian reservations and we have tons of missions and so we uh, we have to you know, work a little bit at uh, being able to afford to send somebody to seminary so been very successful actually of um, just working this whole thing off of donations. Uh, the car itself was donated and uh, you know, the, the time and the, the expertise and, and so many of the parts, everything like that. So my job is just to not get attached to the car, right? We have to finish the car and, and raffle it and say goodbye to it and try not to, try not to think about it anymore.